This is Dorksai Cookies, and I am Squirrel Girl LV at ALA 2018 with Michelle. And you are dressed up as Anubis. Anubis. Now, she says she's only been cosplaying for how long? Just one year. One freaking year, and look at this. Look at this. How? How in one year did you master all of this? Um, I don't know. It's only my third cosplay. I just got some reference material and had some good ideas. So you made this entire outfit, right? Yes. So what part was probably your most challenging piece? I would say the corset was the hardest. I was kind of having a nervous breakdown like a day before con because I was not finished. So <laughs> trying to get all the pieces on was hectic. And this is the scale, right? Yes. Now, how did you make the scales? Um, I bought the scales online, but okay. I added uh, the each gemstone to the mm -hmm. tip of them, and then I ended up sewing it on individually um, to the corset itself, yeah, one it, by one. Yeah. That probably took you how long? About. Um, a couple days. Again, really? and also, Not you know, that long. getting to con, panicking, being in my hotel room, and then telling everyone, "I'll see you later. Yeah. I have to finish my cosplay." So. <laughs> It, it looks great. Thank you. And being that it's only your third, I cannot wait to see what your tenth one looks like. Yeah, I'm excited. this is amazing. Now, let's talk about a little bit more of the details. So you have all these things going on. Mm -hmm. And uh, what part is your absolute favorite? Um, like, I, hmm. <laughs> I think the scales themselves and the necklace I really like. Yeah, this is just absolutely fantastic. I love it. Now, did you, you sewed all of them, right? I cut, um, the base of the necklace is made with um, like a faux leather that's gold already. Okay. I cut the lace and then I just, to size, I hot glue, glue, I hot glue gunned it on and then I glued on each piece of the gemstones onto yeah. it. And then attached everything with, um, you know, like elastic rope. Right. It looks amazing. Thank you. Like, I wouldn't even know that you hot glued it. It just mm -hmm. looks seamless to me thank you so you did a great job thank you you've only been doing it a year mm -hmm. what are some of the things that you have learned on your way so far <sighs> a lot <laughs> to be uh, very patient and be persistent but I learned how to deal with fabrics better um, the two other cosplays I have are very fabric based as well okay so coming from those not knowing anything to doing this one I learned how to you know fold the fabric better to make better seams um, to attach like fabric to bras as this is what my base is okay. for the top so yeah the fabric um, I feel like the prop the staff itself was probably the easiest huh. to do so okay. yeah but um, I learned a lot a lot of just having to improvise quick improvis improvisations when things don't work out it's like how can I be making this better um, and then, you know, as I'm driving to work, I'm thinking about my cosplay and I have <laughs> ideas of, you know, what can I do and, you know, oh, I should fold it like this and put it like that and it'll probably look good. And then I get home, I try it and it works out. So that's nice when you're, uh, do you, uh, do you have a long ride to work? I don't, not oh. anymore. I used to, but yeah, now it's a quick ride. So sometimes it's a little daydreaming at work <laughs> in the office of what I should be doing, but <laughs> Um, hey, it works. It's fine, yeah. Still have my job, so. <laughs> <laughs> That's all that really matters. Yeah. Because the job is what pays for this beautiful it, outfit. It's very expensive, yes. <laughs> I'm sure. So, um, how did you make your your claws? The claws I actually bought. So, the claws oh. I bought, the base of the course that I bought, obviously, like the shoes I bought. Um, I bought them off Etsy. They oh. came uh, tipped, dipped in black already. They were okay. bronze dipped in black. I just brightened up the bronze with some gold finish to match okay. the gold accents. So they're a little bit altered, but yeah. Okay, that's cool though. So this is Ben, Dorkside Cookies with Michelle. See you guys later. Bye.